Welcome to EdTech Hustle. My name is Rich, and today we're going to be exploring another brand new AI tool from Canva. This one is called Grab Text. Before we get into the video, if you like this type of content, please feel free to subscribe to EdTech Hustle. You can select the card at the top right of the video. Let's get started. So here's an example of a image that I found on the internet. Actually, I downloaded it from Canva, but I think this will work really good for demonstration purposes. I like this image and everything else about it, but I don't quite like this font or this message. I want to change that. So it's going to be a little hard for me to change that without having the ability to edit the text. And that's where our new AI tool comes in. It's called Grab Text, and as you can probably tell by the name, it will let you lift or edit any text off of any image. Canva will then do its best to try to match the font automatically using AI, which will then allow you to edit any of the text on the photo. So let me go ahead and select grab text. There we go. So you can see that I can now edit my text. You can kind of see if you look a little bit closely. You can see where the old lettering was, but if I kind of put this here, it's, it's not very noticeable. Now, Canva did its best to match up the text in here, but I can go in and select any type of text that I want. I can probably even maybe myself find something closer to that font by just scrolling here and checking. Obviously, I can make it bigger or smaller, move text around, that sort of thing. The other thing down here, you'll notice that it also changed this text. So I can go in and change this subscribe text as well. I can edit this however I want. So I can say, welcome back to Ad Tech Hustle. There we go. Now you'll notice sometimes it will do things like remove, there was a little bell icon at the bottom here and must have thought that that was text and removed it. So it will do things like that. So it's not 100% perfect, but hopefully it will do what you want it to. So now I'm gonna to go to my next thumbnail. This actually comes from the Buffalo Bills YouTube channel. And this is perfect because if this is the type of image that you want to change where you exactly, you know that font right, right there, like I know that's, that's League Spartan, you can use this and completely change just the text at the top of the screen really easily without doing a whole lot of work. Okay, there we go. The text has been grabbed, it's edited, I can move it around, but that's just not the right font. But luckily, just from using this font, I know that it's League Spartan. There we go, it's the same exact font that's on there. Okay, I can just change it like that, maybe make it a little bit smaller, and I have the same exact font that was on that original photo, I just was able to use this tool to remove the text and to edit it. Same thing here, here's just an article from The Verge. If I select that, that snip and if I used grab text, Canva is going to take all of the text on here and make it completely editable. So if someone gives you a, a screenshot of an article or a document that you can't edit, Here's one way that you can do this. Again, you're gonna have to probably go in and, and change the font. Even even Google got a, got um, grabbed, I guess, kind of here. Um, so in some cases, it may not be the best option, but it is something that will work. Here's another one. This actually comes from Adobe Express. If we use our grab text, it's going to identify that text, allow me to change it. So this is a tool that I think will save you a lot of time. Like I said, it's not completely completely perfect, but I think in some situations where you have an image with text on it and you don't have the original to easily change, this might be an option. So it is called Grab Text. It's one of the AI tools that's available in Canva. And if you don't have it now, you should have it soon. So thank you so much for watching this video. If you have any questions, go ahead and leave it in the comments section below.